shows that you have the gumption, the gung-ho, the get-up-and-go to make you stand out from your average rank-and-file patrolman. This could be the one goal. LAPD, could you stand clear of the body, please? Has anyone called an ambulance? We've called an ambulance and the police, but I'm afraid he's dead. Okay, stand further back and move along. It's your choice, but make it quick, people. Hey, Cole. You got here quick. My beat crosses 7th Street. Okay. You're first reporting, then. We'll get a perimeter going and move the crowd on. You better see what you can find out before the homicide dicks show up. I'll be with you in a moment. One nice thing about Egypt. Broad daylight. Crowded street. Now I've seen everything. Everybody stay back. Let us do our job. C. Galetta. Layway receipt. Pearl earrings. Made out to Bank of Arcadia. FN Browning, serial number 011138. Might need to run it by a gun store. Eagleson's gun store is a couple blocks from here. All right, all right. Yes, it's a dead person. This guy in the crowd thinks he saw something, Cole. You better take a statement. Don't you people have anything better to do? Sir, I'm Officer Phelps. What exactly did you see? I heard the shots. I thought it was a car backfiring. Uh, I saw a girl run at the shoe store. Speak to the witness before homicide arrives, Phelps. If you think she's lying, don't be afraid to get forceful. Verbally, of course. And don't accuse her of anything without proof. Lawyers love that shit. And if you're sure she's straight up, try the general approach. See what you can coax out of her. Officer Phelps, miss, I'm here about the shooting. Did you know the victim? <laughs> he was my boss. Mr. Gage. Mr. Gage's first name? Everett. And you are? Galleta. Clovis Galleta. You think you could tell me exactly what happened, miss? I look around the shops at lunch. I was in a store when Mr. Gage, my boss, bursts in yelling that I'm late on my lunch. And? We came back. I was angry. I walked in front. I heard shots. I turned and saw Mr. Gage fall. Coletta, you know what happened and why. You're going to tell me. There's nothing to tell. 
I've done nothing wrong. How can you prove different? Your pearl earrings, Miss Galetta. You've been paying for them for a whole year. Stop lying and tell me what happened at the jewelry store. Oh, God. I won't lose the earrings, will I? You could lose your freedom, you little fool, if you don't stop obstructing a murder investigation. Mr. Kalu. Edgar Kalu. He runs the jewelry store. He's showing me a lovely watch. Mr. Gage bursts in. Mr. Kalu gets very angry with Mr. Gage, and they start yelling at each other. Mr. Gage tells me that all of the things in the store are junk, nickel-plated, made in Japan, and yells at me to get back to work. Then what happened? We get back here, and I hear a loud bang. Mr. Gage clutches at his back. I hear another bang, and another, and another. Mr. Gage falls to his knees. It looked very painful. Which jewelry store? Hartfields. Broadway, between 5th and 6th. Did you see the person who shot Mr. Gage? Of course I did. Mr. Callow looked very angry. He kept firing the gun. He kept pulling the trigger. He threw the gun in a bin and turned and walked away. You're making me angry, Miss Galetta. Is that what you want? Tell me why Mr. Kalu shot Mr. Gage. Mr. Gage hates Jews. A lot of people do. It's not my fault if he has nice things. How many shots did you hear, Miss Galetta? It's difficult to remember. It sounded like there were so many, and they were so loud. you to concentrate, Miss Galetta. Even minor details can become important later on. Well, there was one bang, and then another, and then three very quickly close together. Five. Thank you for your help, ma'am. You've been very brave. We'll need you to make a formal statement about what happened to Mr. Gage. Does that mean I can still collect my... My... Never mind. Yes, officer, I'll make a statement. We have the murder weapon. And the murderer. The girl saw it all. Our killer works at a jewelry store called Hartfields. That's a couple of blocks from here. You thinking what I'm thinking? Tate! Maintain the perimeter. One nice thing about Egan.
officers. What can I do you for? Officers Phelps and Dunn, sir, Wilshire Division. We need you to trace a serial number. Sure. What's the make and model? FN Browning, model 1922. The serial number is 01138. You don't say. Well, I didn't sell it. Europeans love them, but it's pretty rare you find one over here. Although I did have one in here a couple of weeks back. Remember the owner? Yeah. Kalu. Edgar Kalu was his name. I think it looks like he'd never been fired, but he brought it in here for cleaning anyway. Then he bought a box of cartridges and he left. You know where we can find Mr. Kalu? Told me he was on his lunch break. Said he worked at Hartfield Jewelry Store just up on Broadway. Thanks for your help. Officer, can I interest you in a new watch? Officer Cole Phelps, are you Edgar Kalu? Uh, no. Uh, Mr. Kalu is out back. He said he'd lie down. I'll buzz him for you. Son of a bitch! Go, Cole, go! Hurry, officer! He's getting away! Kalu! Get back here! Lock him up and throw away the key! Next time, you're mine. Edgar Kalu! You're under arrest for the murder of Everett Gage! 